What punch knocks the most people out in MMA? It's the cross. The cross is a devastating strike to throw. It's your dominant hand. But where does the power come from? The power comes from your legs. So let's go over some of the body mechanics. You generate the power from your legs. So we gotta go from the ground up. We need to activate our calf muscles, our hamstring muscles, our glutes, some of the strongest muscles in our body. Core, twist. So let's start by opening the heel up, beginning the rotation, followed by the knee, the hip, the shoulder, elbow joint, and then the fist. So when you rotate, it's this entire side of your body behind the punch. All of those main muscle groups, that's gonna increase your power when you activate those main muscle groups. So, so what are some of the common mistakes we see? So some of the common mistakes, the punch goes out straight, but then it's looped back down. Never loop your punches. It goes straight out, straight back in. You can also use your shoulder to help protect your jaw. Instead of bringing that shoulder low, bring it up a little bit higher, that way your jaw will be safe, especially with those MMA gloves. They're so small, a lot of those punches sneak through, so use your shoulder to protect half that side of your face. Another common mis mistake we see when beginners are starting out is they throw the cross, but they drop the other hand. So we never wanna do that. We always wanna make sure we're protecting the other side. You can see my left hand, it comes up to protect the temple, then I'm back in my stance. You rotate, protect, and then return to your stance. So when you're throwing the cross, generate power from the ground up using the major muscle groups of your legs, and then make sure you're protecting both sides of your head, left side and right side. To continue learning, check out the next video on the hook, and as always, please remember, like, share, and subscribe.